This is the final question of the round. It's worth $300, but more importantly, the contestant with the least amount of money on the other side of this stays home with nothing. So good luck to everybody. The two possible answers here are too much or not enough. The question is, what did single women say is the worst kind of hair for a man to have? Is it too much or not enough? What is the worst kind of hair for a man to have, according to single women? All right, Danielle, we'll start with you. You're tied for second place. You have $200. This is for $300. Bucks. What do you think? I have to go with my own um, instinct on this one and say that I would rather have a man that is a little bald on the top than a man that has his head hair on his back. So I'm gonna go with too much. <laughs> Danielle says too much. <laughs> Mike, what do you think, sir? Well, as a gentleman uh, who is probably <laughs> challenged, I have to stay true to my heart and say, no more mullets, too much, too, too much. Too much hair is, that's a problem for the single women. Billy, what do you think? Do you agree? I think the days of hair all the way down to the middle of your back for guys are gone. I think Bruce Willis brought it back, so I'm going to say too much. Too much hair. All right, Jackie, you're the final say here. What do you think for $300? Well, I hope I'm the rebel with the cause because I think that when people do the comb over on top because they're balding, trying to hold on to hair they don't have, that's horrible. So I put not enough. All right, Jackie's going her own road with not enough. Well, for $300, the correct answer, very close with 51% of the vote. The answer is too much. So Mike, Danielle, and Billy, they're all banking $300. Jackie, you've been eliminated, sweetheart. I'm sorry.